Hey everyone, Mr. Sujano here. I've got a bunch of great emulation news for you today. We're talking about Sega Saturn, PS2, Nintendo Switch, Nintendo 3DS, Commodore 64, and RetroArch. Let's get started. All right, we'll kick things off here talking about PS2 emulation on Windows, Mac, Linux, Android, and iOS with Play, the PS2 emulator that does not require a BIOS file. Play was just updated to version 0.53. Now this new version brings about some fixes, some improvements, and some changes. First up, save states and loading states are a heck of a lot faster thanks to ZSTD compression. And compatibility improvements here, or Tachi Collection games and Fantasy Zone are now playable. And they've also fixed a couple of memory card issues here in 50 Cent Bulletproof and Obscure the Aftermath. Now it's no secret that Play is behind powerhouses like PCSX2 and AetherSX2 in overall game compatibility, but Play is getting better. At this point in time, 26.19% of games tested are playable in Play, and 53.17% of games are in-game. This is increasing and it's only getting better. Next up here, we're talking about Sega Saturn emulation on Windows and Android with Yabison Shiro 2. Yabison Shiro 2 version 1.9 was just released. This new update includes some bug fixes and some Mew bootable games. We've got SD Gundam G Century S, uh, Full Cowled Mini Yonku Super Factory, and Galaxy of uh, Fraulein Una 3. Now version 1.9 is already available on the Play Store, but if you're using this on Windows, I will drop a link to their site in the description below. Feel free to check it out. You can pick up the latest version. Next up here, if you're a C64 fan, you might like this update. We're talking about Denise, which is a C64 emulator with PAL shaders and also run ahead. Version 1.13 was just released. Denise is available for Windows, Mac, and Linux, and I will drop a link to this page in the description below. It is free, and as far as I know, it's also open source. Now, version 1.13 adds in a whole bunch of stuff. It's actually a pretty big update. Uh, they've added in a precise FPS counter, an option to render in a separate thread, and on top of that, they fixed jerky scrolling for Linux and Mac. They've also added in a new option to change the size of the window for the correct aspect ratio. Uh, if I scroll down here, they've added in auto fire and also added in an option to allow opposite directions. So if you don't like SOCD cleaning, well, you can just turn that off. On top of that, they've added in macOS M1 support. Next up here, we're talking about 3DS emulation on Android with Citra, just not the version of Citra that's on the Google Play Store. It's the subscribe to Mr. Sujano version available on GitHub, Citra MMJ. Citra MMJ is a fork of Citra geared towards performance as opposed to emulation accuracy, and this new update introduces dark mode. And Citra MMJ is 100% free, it's open source, and I'll drop a link to it in the description below. Feel free to check it out. Next up here, we're talking about RetroArch on Steam, and RetroArch on Steam just added in a brand new core, Free Chaff. Arguably, this is one of the more obscure cores out there. It's for the Fairchild Channel F video entertainment system. If you know what this is, if you play this, let me know in the comments below. Last up here, we're talking about Nintendo Switch emulation on Android with Skyline, because why wouldn't we? It's pretty much customary at this point. Rayman is running between 50 and 60 frames a second, and Hollow Knight is running pretty much at 60 frames a second. And someone asked me about this the other day. Yes, Dragon Ball Fighters is booting. But anyways, that is all I've got for you in this one. Straight to the point, haul stuff and no fluff. Let me know your thoughts on anything we talked about today in the comments below, and we did talk about quite a bit. This was a pretty big video. If you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't like this video, leave a like. Hit that subscribe button, check out my other videos. Don't tempt fate, save your state.